for safety rules. That's right, we got some safety rules. First, if you need guest assistance or have a medical emergency or drop anything of value off the side of the tram or have any sound or video issues, just reach up and grab the red E cord that runs along the center of the ceiling of the tram and I'll be back to assist you as soon as it's safe to do so. Otherwise, during the need assistance, studio is private property. Uh, and if you drop your phone or uh, can't wait to use the restroom, pull the cord and remain seated. Please, no smoking of any kind during the tour. Be prepared for our tour today features loud noises, sudden tram movements, fire effects, and many water effects. We want to have your cameras out for some great photo opportunities, but keep an eye on them so they don't get wet. Finally, for your safety in those around you, please do not use selfie sticks while on board. So keep us safe here in Universal City every single day. That's not a set. We don't film there. Uh, but where we do the is uh, on our lawn, which is where we're heading right now. You'll see some more movie posters on the sides of the tram, but currently we're going to head to the front lawn. The front lawn is where we have our first view. Yes, adventure awaits us as we return to Skull Island, so hold on to all of your belongings and remain seated at all times, because we never know what awaits us on. Ford Anglia from Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, the Fry's Electronics Van from Trevor Peel's Nope, Craw Daddy from Us, and two Jeeps and the Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle from Transformers. Now I know that Bradley Infantry Fighting 
big vehicle looks like a real tough tank, I promise you, it is not. Uh, other than a metal chassis it sits on so you can move around, it's made entirely out of plywood and PVC pipe painted to look like a real tank, but I wouldn't recommend taking it into battle. It would not last very long. We do have some more picture cars coming up now. I'll let my friends see a boat that just narrowly survived a Spinosaurus attack in the third Jurassic Park film. Then, on your left-hand side, you'll see the mobile lab unit used in the Lost World Jurassic Park that dangled off the edge of a cliff in Costa Rica. It actually wasn't a cliff and it wasn't Costa Rica. It was a parking structure right here on our lot. Now, we love dinosaurs here, which is why we keep them in these cages so that... Oh no, the cages are empty. That's not good. Every time we have loose dinosaurs in the on the tour. I don't know how long ago they got them out. So they really couldn't be anywhere at this point. Just keep them out of the way. Pull out your kids. Oh, Jesus! Oh, what's up there? Oh my god. It's a huge role in the Jurassic Park series. A hurricane fit the strands of characters always make the scene more dramatic. Filmmakers need to be able to control the camera. Obviously, they need to keep control of the sound of thunder. And thunder is usually added in post-production as a sound effect, but the actors need to react to it on the day of the filming. We do it practically, like you see here, and we can make a little bit of rain. That rain is coming from sprinklers up above the tram that shoots that water way up into the air so that it falls back down to the ground naturally. That is a process that filmmakers call gravity. That uh, oh, rain the scene. A very light rain makes for a nice romantic scene. A heavy downpour can make for a dark, intense, dramatic scene. So filmmakers can adjust how hard that rain is falling to adjust the tone of their scene. Oh, 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 Cars, you know, three and four, you'll see this. Now we'll leave uh, old Mexico behind and head to the old west. Welcome to Six Points, our western sets here on the line. Take a look to your left hand side. Six Points here is where uh, a lot of the ninth film from Quentin Tarantino was filmed, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Sorry, Leonardo DiCaprio and Brad Pitt. So we're right over here on our left hand side in Six Points. Uh, now we are approximately halfway through the tour, so I just want to remind everyone to stay seated during the entire tour. Oh, there's somebody. Hello! Um, Hello! The studio is private property, and if you drop your phone or just can't wait to use the restroom, pull the red cord to get my attention, and I'll be back to assist you. But do remain seated on the train. As we pull out of our six point sets, take a look to your left. You will see some sound stages where you found the voice. Uh, new season coming up with some new judges. Chance the rapper, Kelly oh Clarkson, uh, is going to be a judge. Now, so our subway station set. This is actually a two-story set. So we have the subway station here on this level, and on the level above us, we have the street filled with cars, and those buildings you name it. And these filmmakers need to film in both levels in the same shot. So that's right here. Currently, the set would be San Francisco. You can tell it was the set decorators who decorated all this with signs.
issue over here. And uh, that just goes to show they don't always film Christmas movies during the holidays. They have to be filmed earlier in the year so that they can be released during the holidays. So uh, if you see something that looks like that this December on TV or uh, in the theaters, then you can say you are here while it was being filmed. But right now, we are approximately 15 minutes from the end of the tour. We will be returning to the theme park shortly. Remember to pull the emergency cord if you need assistance and remain seated. At I'll tell you who I am, boy. I'm the reason bad guys use a knife. Right it's a boogeyman, that's his mom. Look at him, he's dead. It's a boogeyman, that's his mom. Look at him, he's dead. And he just lost control of this whole operation. Don't 
think you're getting away? Find the cops! Way to go, Levy. Don't let another little shot. Not gonna happen. Don't worry, I got this. Unfortunately, that does mean we have reached the end of our tour. I want to thank you all so much for joining me here today.